I got the goods. I got the goods. Girl, I got the goods. I got the goods. I got the goods. Yeah. Welcome to game day, man. I used to never like touch a camera on game day. I don't know. I used to be like so serious. Still serious, just like I just need to start having fun with footy. Otherwise, I forget why I played footy in the first place. I'm not playing for ISP this week. I am playing for Richmond Bulldogs. This is my first game back from my hamstring. It's still like I know it's there and it's not a hundred percent, but I'm gonna say it's like 90. 93% like from being fully recovered. I'm pretty much ready. This is a must win game for us and there's like three teams at the bottom. Look, I'm not even gonna try to tell you how it works because I don't really know how it works myself. We are gonna have some fun game day meal. Always eggs benedict. Bam. And then it depends on what time lunch is. Oh, sorry, I pushed play. Bam. Finally back after seven seven weeks so i'm gonna be like hella unfit because you can't train to be game fit i mean you can do as many crossfit trainings you can do as many f45 trainings as you want none of them is like even equivalent to like game day fitness oh gee when did we ask i don't know why i kept talking <laughs> I'm like three hours early to the game, which is good. I love being early. I hate being late anywhere. I would rather be five hours early than one minute late. One thing that I can, the only thing I can nail is my preparation. At breakfast, I like to write down my goals for the game. My goal is number one is always over a hundred meters. It's a bit hard to find out stats in this level, but I think I'll know personally. Goal number two is talking, heaps of talking. Make sure I'm connected with my center. I don't train with these guys, so it makes it a hundred times harder and three have fun make sure i have fun this is why i play footy i play to have fun and i don't think anyone should ever forget that <sighs> after breakfast after I please don't park next to me after i write my goals i like to drive to the field don't want to drive anywhere else slow music only slow music to the field when i was younger i used to i used to start pumping myself like my playlist were like we about to conquer it who 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 we about to conquer it, young Polynesian, is that what the problem is? I learned this from Iloni Vunakede, like he was like, gee, you don't want to peak too early. So he keeps calm until like an hour or two before the game, that's when you change up your playlist. So I took this from him, until I'm in the change room, that's when you can like, mm, start to turn up. And I need to take a shot. Could I grab um, the club Angus, please? Yeah. Uh, could I get that in a combo with a large mocha? Thank you. Thank you, that's all. Macca's isn't really my go-to after games, it's straight chocolate, I just go chocolate on chocolate But bro, I was starving, I, I haven't eaten since breakfast If you didn't know, we got that dub, that's why I got the polo on Because we've won, nah just represent hard any day bro, Body is hella sore, we lost that game, then we could have been kicked out of the competition Now I'm gonna go home <laughs> And now we're home. Yes, I've been talking a lot in this video, so I'm gonna stop. Have a time. <laughs> Why am I happy? Not only did we get that dub, but you know when you just get those beautiful surprises, I was walking to my door, I said, yo, what is this little thing? Boom! It's not little, it's a big black. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. I wonder who it's from. Ha! <laughs> Gay. I'm kidding, I know who it's from and I know what it is, but I haven't seen it in real life, so let's open this bad boy up. Oh, she told me she wrapped it up real good, but like, this is... <sighs> Check this out. Yeah. <laughs> 